Hey guys, I'm back with another video and today I'm going to be tasting snacks that I found while I was raiding the supermarkets in Peru. And I'm really excited about this video because there's so many snacks I've never seen before and they all look so delicious. So the first thing that I want to try is this. It's from the company called Field and it's called Choco Soda. And I got this because there was a girl at the checkout that was eating this and it looked so delicious. Um, I think it's just chocolate coated crackers. The way that she was eating them made them look so good. So here they are. And yes, I think they are just chocolate coated soda crackers. And I'm excited to eat this one. So let's give it a taste. Mmm. Mm-hmm. This tastes exactly as if Pocky was in a square form. On the inside, it's a super light soda cracker coated with milk chocolate. And the milk chocolate tastes like the milk chocolate coating on Pocky. So if you guys like Pocky, you guys would definitely like Choco Soda. This also reminds me of a homemade treat that we make in the States. And basically, it's just crackers with melted chocolate on top. But this is super convenient that you can just go to the store and buy Choco Soda. The next thing that I have is another chocolate cookie, and this one's called Chin Chin. And it looks to be like a chocolate cookie with rainbow sprinkles. So... Anything with rainbow sprinkles, I'm pretty much about it. So let's give this a taste, and they look really cute. Mmm! I wasn't expecting for the inside to be chocolate also. This one's more of an artificial chocolate tasting cookie, but the sprinkles give it a really nice texture and a really nice crunch. Alright, so let's taste more chocolate cookies while we're at it. This one's called Choco Boom. Choco Bum. I really just got it because the name is Choco Bum and I thought that was really fun. And this is made by the brand Victoria. Can you tell I was in the mood for chocolate cookies when I went on the supermarket raid? They look like this. It's a really thin chocolate cookie. Mmm. Mmm. This one's more like a chocolate coated Ritz cracker. So the Choco Soda was a chocolate covered soda cracker. This one tastes like a chocolate coated Ritz cracker. Okay, moving on. The next thing that I have are these casino cookies. And I picked these up because they are the Lucuma flavor. So Lucuma is a native fruit in Peru and you can find many things that are Lucuma flavored from cookies like this to ice cream and popsicles and many things. Many things are Lucuma flavored. I haven't though actually found like a fresh Lucuma so I don't know what the fresh fruit tastes like but I will say that things that are flavored with Lucuma so far have tasted a little bit like chestnuts. So these and give them a taste. Okay, and these are the casino cookies. They have a nice casino logo on the outside. Cookies are really buttery and sweet. I can't really taste the lucuma filling though, so I'm going to try to break the cookie apart and just try to get a little bit of the filling. And the filling tastes really mild. Maybe a little bit chestnut flavor, but mostly it just tastes sweet. Not much flavor on the filling at all. I have to say I'm a little bit disappointed in this one because I've had had these casino cookies in the coconut flavor, and the coconut flavor was excellent. I thought the lucuma flavor would be more flavorful as well, but also again, I've never tasted fresh lucuma, so maybe this is what lucuma tastes like and I just don't know. Either way, they're still a good cookie because the cookie outside is really good. It's really crispy and buttery and sweet. Okay, let's switch it up a little bit now. The next thing that I have are these and they're called lentejas. They're made by the company Nestle. They seem to just be chocolate candies that look like this. Let's try the orange one first. Hmm. Mm hmm And yep, these are just chocolate with a candy shell. Very similar to M&M's but with the distinct flavor of Nestle chocolate. I feel like Nestle has its own really distinct flavor of milk chocolate that's really milky and sweet and creamy. Really good. And the last sweet thing that I have is this and it's called Doña Peppa. And I love the character that they have on the outside. It's this really fantastic lady with a sprinkles hat. I want a sprinkles hat. Also made by the company Field. And wow, it's so cute on the inside. Sprinkles are like pastel colored and I'm excited to give this one a taste because anything with rainbow sprinkles really it gets me. Mmm. Mm hmm Mmm. And I thought it might have been a candy bar, but it's a chocolate covered sandwich cookie. And on the inside, I think it's. Oh no! 
Just kidding, it's not a sandwich cookie. I think it's actually just two cookies and they were stuck together. The cookie is sweet and buttery and a little bit crisp. The milk chocolate is really sweet, so this is a really sweet cookie, but I love the fact that it has all these sprinkles on it and it adds a really fun, crunchy texture. So yeah, Dona Peppa, I think I'm a fan. Okay, so moving on to salty snacks. I have these Peru nachos, and these are chips made with this purple corn that's so famous and prevalent here in Peru. You see purple corn products everywhere. They make juice from it, candies, ice cream, popsicles, and now I found purple corn chips. Cool. And they are these purple, grayish purple chips. They smell just like tortilla chips, so let's taste if they have any kind of distinguishable purple corn flavor. Mm. And no, they just taste like tortilla chips, like regular tortilla chips. If I didn't see that they were purple, I wouldn't be able to tell that they were made with purple corn at all. They just taste like normal tortilla chips, like the ones made from Tostitos. Still good though, because I still really like tortilla chips, I just wish that they were a little bit more special somehow. Okay, and the last thing that I have are these Lay's chips, and the flavor is called Aji Peruano, so that just means Peruvian chilies. You know I'm excited to taste this one because you guys know how much I like spicy food, so I hope that these chips are spicy. That's what they look like on the inside. A little bit disappointing that the bag is like less than half full, but here's a pretty good looking chip. Mm. Mm. They're not very spicy. They're not spicy at all actually. They don't really taste like chili flavor either. What do these taste like? Tastes like a mix between barbecue and onion flavor. Not really chili flavor at all. So yeah, I'm not really sure what I was expecting, but I wish that they were spicy. But no, they just taste like a mix between barbecue and onion flavor, which is still a really nice flavor, but just not what I imagined when I heard that it was ahi peruano. So that's all the snacks that I have from Peru right now. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, please be sure to thumbs up it. Please also subscribe to my channel for more videos of me eating my way through South America. And please let me know if you've tried any of these treats before and let me know what you guys think about them. I hope everything is awesome on your side of the world and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!